What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy Miguel Tucker, aka Big Fin Ball, aka your baby mama's emergency contact, aka your mother's favorite entanglement. And before we get started, I just want to let you guys know that the Miguel Tucker TV channel was now accepted donations. So make sure you guys donate to the channel so we can keep pumping out that exclusive content for you guys. Anything helps. <sighs> oh my God. So um, I'm on IG earlier. I'm just scrolling, doing my little regular one too, looking at twerk videos, uh, reading hate comments. You know the whole the regular. Um, so I, I see that Shauna Brooks. Recently just dropped a diss track on her IG channel towards the boss of Massachusetts, buck breaking, bussy bandit, Benzino. Okay. Um, if you guys want to hear the, the full track, I'm going to let you, I'm going to leave the uh, link in the description box for uh, Shauna Brooks IG page. And uh, yeah, it's crazy. First couple of lines go, I was getting some head by Benzino, no neck. Out the gate, you just come out just. You come out the gate with a machete, my guy. This is crazy. And um, Bizzino just recently just uh released a diss track towards the blogs and towards uh his alleged uh ex girlfriend transgender Shauna Brooks called uh Benzino against the world. I don't know if you guys you know check that out. I'll leave it in the description box below if you guys want to hear that. But it's been crazy. It's like Benzino's been taking L's all year, bro. All since two thousand. 22 has started first we got the first we got the situation with uh him and his ex Optia. then we got um the twitter exchange between him and his daughter and now we have this alleged uh relationship with transgender female shauna brooks it's like is benzino ever gonna win and honestly i just feel like benzino's being cyber bully at this point but i kind of feel like he brought it on himself by you know just releasing just unleashing just uh just a hell of just gay slurs when you know the information was released that he had an alleged relationship with shauna brooks he was calling her all type of punks the f word just down in the whole lgbtq community you know and i, I just couldn't get behind that because it was just so vulgar i'm like if it wasn't true why are you going so hard to just, you know going so hard to you know just to prove your masculinity if you're securing your sexuality you don't have to really go that hard and you know this somebody else's like sexuality or just make their way of life seem like you know it's 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 a it's a bad thing you understand what i'm saying and i i never understood that like i see that a lot like hip-hop like not just now hip-hop because you know a lot of stuff has changed you see Lil Nas X, saucy santana you know the whole nine but like i feel like you know it's a lot of older heads who still, ha who still have that mentality but a lot of these guys that be going so extra hard to protect their masculinity and just come off like they're just so extra bravado they like those girls they like those t girls bro don't get it don't get it effed up okay these niggas got wives they got children they go on to soccer practice with their kids and then they go up and lay with a man afterwards okay it's crazy get bent over cheeks bulldozer beat down okay so that's why i i really don't I, I don't take no dude serious when he's just he he they constantly take aim at the gay community calling them just all type of slurs and everything and just so hateful towards that community because deep down they like that type of stuff okay so yeah man i i, I kind of felt like you brought this on yourself and um you got to get in front of this man you got to get in front of this you got to be strategic when you respond to situations like this okay you can't go on these interviews you can't get on these lives and just respond in an emotional fashion because it's gonna make you it's gonna make it look like it's true if it's not true then why are you so angry why are you so angry you know but i digress um i hope you get it together i really do and um i I, I just wish nothing but peace and prosperity for you, man. I just hope you just you just get it together for real, for real. But uh, yeah, that's gonna do it for me, man. Uh, you guys, let me know what you guys want me to react to next. What you guys want me to uh, do commentary over? What you guys would like me to report on next? You know, I do everything, man. I'm jack all trades. You know, I rap, I produce. You know, what I'm saying I do. Uh, I, I report on different topics. You know, I do reactions. Uh, I do movie reviews. Hey, I even tap dance and I make a mean smoothie. You understand what I'm saying? But um, uh, I, I hope you guys are having a good day. I hope you guys are drinking lots of water. And I hope you guys are taking care of yourself and staying in a, a good mental headspace. You understand what I'm saying? And, um, yeah, that's going to do it for me, man. Uh, you guys make sure you wash your ass correctly. Make sure... You're brushing your teeth before you go to bed. Uh, make sure you love your families. Make sure you're taking care of your families. And, um, yeah, uh, make sure you guys are just staying above all this madness out here. Um, 
do not get discouraged by all this artificial BS, especially that you see on like the internet because it's not real. It's only here to cause confusion and disruption in your life. Um, it's, it's here to hold you back from completing your goals and, you know, just being the best version of yourself. You understand what I'm saying? And you don't need that right now. It's grind time, you know? It's grind time. Is 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 this is the this is the time and season for you to be um the version of yourself that you always imagine, that you always hope for, that you always wish for today and tomorrow and this season, this year. This is the year for you to actually come into your own. You, you understand what I'm saying? And don't let anybody stop you. Don't let anybody say don't let any naysayer say that you, you're not you're not fit for the position that you, you you're striving for. You understand what I'm saying? Because you are perfect. And I'm saying that just because you, I'm saying that just in case you, you haven't heard that today. Okay. You're perfect. You're doing a good job and I'm proud of you. Okay. And, um, I wish number but peace and prosperity for you and your families. And, um, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Almighty. It be silky as shit. Yeah, nigga, tell him how you love me. Stop lying as shit. shit. He be feeding me crabs while I'm gripping his ass. <laughs> nigga said I'm trying to trap him. Has to sit back and laugh. Since you on a press run, tell him how you love this kitty cat. cat. Tell him how I got your money up. You couldn't get, get a cat. cat. Hope you start your OnlyFans. Now you getting profit. Now you big man. 50 cent the clock. Oh, yeah. Before I leave, though, before I leave, um, make sure y'all like, comment and subscribe. Um, get me in that algorithm. You know what I'm saying? I'm starting to do these reactions like full time now. Yeah. Get me in that algorithm. So, you know, I'm trying to grow a little bit, get to that first 1K. And um, yeah, hit that um, hit that notification bell so I can be the first. So you be the first one to get the notifications when I do drop another video. OK, so you can get straight to it. Cut through the noise. All that. OK. Love y'all. Be great. Big fan ball.